Hey guys, what's going on? It's Josh Kaplan. I'm here with Brittany Kern from Legally Blondes. What's up? Just chilling here at Lounge Level, <laughs> level three. 3 Lounge. <laughs> yeah, that's how cool we are that we get to chill at cool places like this in Hollywood. It is pretty cool. Yeah, so <laughs> Legally Blondes, my first instinct is to say, well, you're the brunette. I am. I'm, so, the, I'm the evil brunette, and actually. So, of course, us brunettes have to play we the have to evil stick ones. Together. Yes. I know, and play the evil ones, but I'm really not in isn't, real life. Yeah, isn't that great, though, <laughs> to be able to, like, you know, because obviously I can tell you're a nice Thank girl. Thank you. Thank you. You know, and we'll clarify that with everyone yes. that she's a nice girl. Thank you. But, I mean, it's got to be awesome to play, you, you know, know it really is the bad girl. Yeah, because just going into the first audition, and the, the lines are so outwardly mean, but the way yeah. I did it was, I was like saying mean things, but saying it as if I was being nice. Right, And so I okay. found out afterwards that I left the room, and the producer And they actually like that. Like, did you use some salt us? And so I threw <laughs> them off a little bit, but it's fun. It's really fun being That's mean. That's almost worse, you know, to it be is. subtle and just get under the skin. Exactly, because then the victim's like, wait a second, was I just It's like a ticking insulted? time bomb. This is true. <laughs> like after this interview, I'm gonna go cry myself to sleep because everything it's that she'll all say. All manipulation, exactly. Right here. It's all an act. I'm excited <laughs> for that, but not at all. So tell us more about the show. About Legally Blondes or the yeah. my new show, Legally Blondes. You know what? Let's talk about the new show. Okay, cool. Yeah, um, my new show is called Men of a Certain Age, Great. and I play Ray Romano's daughter on it. And oh, he, nice. He's awesome. Yeah, he's hysterical. He is. It's just fun being on set with him and like Mike yeah. is our showrunner because they're comedians. Right. And so they'll just break out into uh, stand-up comedy on set. Really? It's the greatest job in the world. I so we start shooting on Monday at Paramount. So That's I'm so awesome. Excited. Well, good luck with that. Thank yeah, you. we'll definitely have to stay tuned for that. Ray Romano is so funny. Mm -hmm. For some reason, what's it like working with him? He's, you know, when I first got to know him, I was just shocked at how down to earth he was. Cause yeah. With, I'm sure the man is just loaded. <laughs> and well, everybody knows who he is and like I remember we were I'm just sure. hanging out in a car we shot all day in a car yeah. and we were just you know just, just shooting kicking them, back just kicking back and talking yeah. about Jersey and the Jersey Shore awesome. and yeah it was cool. Ocean City Seaside Heights represent <laughs> <laughs> yes. why don't you give us uh, your favorite moment on the set so far oh boy um, okay I know what it is I just thought of it okay in the first scene that I'm in in the pilot mm -hmm. I um I get out of the car and I go bye dad love ya and I kiss him on the cheek yeah by far my favorite moment because ever since I was like 10 and I used to watch everybody loves Raymond yeah the biggest crush on Ray <laughs> like the biggest little girl wow. crush wow like I thought Brad Pitt was nothing and I liked Ray Romano move over Brad Pitt move over Ray Brad Romano Pitt. <laughs> Ray is in the house and so they almost forgot to have me kiss him and it was in the script so to the director I was like you know I um I kiss him on the cheek here by the way <laughs> And so inside, I was like, Wow, yes. that's really funny. So that was my favorite moment so far. Yeah, kissing Ray Romano. I mean, yeah. that's I, something everyone <laughs> aspires to do at one point in their Quiet. life, to be able to kiss Ray Romano. He's I mocking mean. me now, but that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's that subtle thing that we're talking about. Exactly. That little undercurrent of something exactly. else. Exactly. <laughs>